Tip number one, you have to go to a part of your room where there's gonna be a lot of natural light. You're looking for big windows, and then if there are windows, if there are blinds, you wanna open up the blinds. If for some reason you don't have any windows in one room, maybe you can go where there's a doorway where you can open the door and allow a lot of natural light in. So you wanna make sure that you open the blinds to make sure there's a lot of natural light on your subject. And what you do there, and once you have your subject in front of your camera, you can tap to his, her face right there, and the sun will come out. That's the way you can adjust the exposure. You can move it up, or you can move it down. So the other feature that you can use on your phone that makes really a good photo is the portrait mode. Select the portrait mode and make sure you're on natural light. So in this case, I wanna brighten her up just a little bit, and take a photo. One of the things that I want you to avoid is shooting or taking photos backlit. Backlit means the light is behind her. You don't want that because it's not going to create a good photo for you. So the other option sometimes if uh, you don't have a window, you can look for a door and stand near the doorway where the light goes in onto your subject and illuminates her. So in this case, I'm going to take a photo of Grace under portrait mode. So now we're outside, so this is probably not the most ideal uh, light to take pictures of because of the harsh lights. So you want to try to avoid taking pictures here because there's like raccoon eyes, a lot of shadows under my nose. If you really have to take a photo in this situation, you might want to maybe have somebody, their, your subject put glasses on or sometimes artistically I'll have my subject like look up and take a photo and make sure that the sun is shining on their face. One of the important things of taking a, a photo with your phone or even with other cameras is making sure you have a good natural light landing on your subject's face. Not a lot of sunspot, she's glowing. So this is the ide ideal situation. Cheese. Cheese. So this is not the ideal situation when it comes to taking pictures because there's not a light, there's not a lot of light on our faces. So your other option is to go under the trees maybe where there's a lot of shade and all of the sunspots are being blocked. So this will really the most ideal, the best location for a photo when the light is just nice and even on your subject's face. So I'm gonna take a quick photo of Grace. One, two, three. Hey guys, thanks for watching. That's Two Minute Tuesday for you. I hope you learned something today, especially learning how to take better photos using your phone, portrait mode, adjusting exposure, and identifying where there's good light. Hit like, subscribe, tell your friends. We'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.